get our wheels, or the side to get the detonator off this rig, and put on the fisher and park or high voltage generator. I just couldn't help myself. This thing's just so fun to play with. Got a gas burner to arc to, got to burn some of the rust off there. And a blender motor, see how that brush motor reacts. That's the one I bypassed one of the field warnings on and played around with in a couple of videos back. So I'm going to attach that to one of the pins on the cord and see what happens. It should speed up at crazy speeds on this bloody voltage. Got to keep cranking it as the engine tries to fire because this thing does bog the engine down a fair bit at low RPM. So got to get it up to momentum and get this thing started and we can start having some fun. Got to wear sunglasses though because the arcs are a bit hard in your eyes. Oh, it's going. Getting away on me there. Going for that motor, straight for the bus. This is my switch. Ah, need more power. The motor won't right turn. More power. Steel lamination in here. A lot of big heavy duty steel lamination around these magnets. Although this thing does spin fast through normal operation in a fish or a proper wash machine. But I'd be very careful about revving this thing up too high because I don't know if this thing can take the um, full four uh, RPM in this motor. Wouldn't want that to go um, blow up from the centrifugal force, that'd be bloody dangerous. Very risky. Power straight to the brushes didn't do anything though. Field warning, I connect this up. This should make the motor go.
Auto State. No, I never saw it, not right. Might have might have it's too late. There you go now, Josh. Squeal the motor. Get a work in the motor. Spin down. What I was trying to say was I can't get this belt any tighter. Doesn't even get bloody warm. It's barely warm. It's only warm from the bloody um, friction of the air and everything. The belt friction, if anything, because of the things that's so loosely fitting. Oh yeah, hot. The winings aren't too hot. Bloody motor got hot there. Interesting. Good little setup there. Thanks for watching.